They're so bent on finding the core, they hardly notice the kid. Lucky for him, a certain famous fairy barge is still afloat. Oh. She sends some squirts crying home as she leaves port. Maybe Nelly knows the way to the core. Maybe she can slip right past all the clamor on the coast. Or maybe not. The security skiff pulls up port side. Nelly's just another windbag to those guns. Just then, the windbags notice who she's sailing with. They're pretty steamed about what happened at Cinderbrick. They try to cut her off. They try to slow her down. Man. Oh. They try to knock her out. Well, Weepin' Nelly tries harder. Try as she might, though, she hits a snag. Kids gotta help her get untangled. Favors for favors. At least she picked a good spot for a break. Cause the core is right there. Then the kid hears an unusual sound. Like a hundred flapping wings. Oh. What's this? Okay. Peckers. They had their own eyes on the core. But why? Well, kid ain't got time to think it over just yet. He finds Weeping Nelly raring to go. Turns oh, out she's got a special friendly. surprise for when the waters get rough. She's gonna need a little help with all them pickers. Crafty things think they're king of the roost now. Cereal. The rest of us only wish what we kind? could die at times like these. Security skiffs keep on coming to starboard side. Don't seem to care what they shoot, as long as they hit something. The windbags get an even better idea. Too much for poor Nelly. She's just got to make one last stop. With the last breath, Nelly gets the kid to solid ground. Rip, Nelly. Solid ground and pick the country. They want that core real bad. Seems a calamity ain't hurt the pecker's appetites. Kid shoes him off, knowing they'll be back. Know how many times Kid nearly fell off the barge back there? Three times. Now, listen close. You should remember this next part. Why go to Prosper Bluff? Nelly's the best.
camping over here. Nope. Used to take an enterprising man or a plain old fool to venture out that far. The city was the most beautiful place in the world. We all knew that. But on the other hand, some folks just yearn to see the things they're told they can't. And that's why you go to Prosper Bluff, ain't it? Oh. There the kid hears something he ain't heard in a long while. And How's it go yeah. again? How am I supposed to get over there then? Thank Jesus. Oh. It's my song that they're playing. Yeah, that's the one. Oh. That voice. Nelly reincarnated. <laughs> something a oh, switch Well, no point explaining what happens next, right? Suffice it to say, kid ain't coming home empty-handed. Yeah, 
And besides, it's like the song goes. They'll be here before too long. We darn near celebrated when the kid got back, didn't we? Zolf never thought he'd see a fellow her again. Now we can we become fast friends. Repopulate. Calamity has that effect on people. Yeah. <laughs> dig my home, you build a wall. But there was more to be done. There was one last core to find. Song play now in here? Uh lame. Most of the era never got a taste of Ceylandia's fine goods. Unless they were born and raised in the city like Zia here. Sure, the world's all gone to pieces farther than the eye can see. But leave it to this gal to point out the amazing view. Girl tried to run away from home one time, but the marshals stopped that, didn't they? So many secrets in there and she can't even read it. Her father's own journal. Oh. Uh -huh. He ain't all that shy. Wait, he? What? Or is he talking about the kid? Uh, whatever. A scientific journal written in Zolf's native tongue. He learned so much from it. Too much. Zolf gets distant sometimes, like all of us. If only I'd known half the secrets of the calamity were tucked away in that book. I had to work to translate it right away. Kid's surprised when I tell him there's only one core left. I shouldn't have believed it either. Behold, the Pantheon. Shall have vengeance. A Kobe. Oh, you can have more than one. Hmm. The gods Try never it. liked competing for people's affections. Finders keepers. Hensa. Javel. And I think it's gonna make it too hard. But we can try. We track the final core beyond the city to the wilds. The wild unknown. Place can eat a man alive. Place is so raw, even the calamity couldn't cook it. Not all of it. Oh. What? Ooh. Nice. Know what's better than having a slinger pistol in a fight? Having two. Kids faster in a slinger with those guns. Savage things lurking at every turn. Pin cushions ain't the worst of it.